right, we're checking out the only game where the thinner the tight ropes become, the thinner my patience becomes. It's GTA. We wanted to find out which vehicle in GTA was the best for tight roping, and so Alex has created a brand new challenge. We've done challenges for long cars and big cars and fast cars, but now it's time to give the narrow cars their due with a tight rope challenge. Alex has created five different sections of tight ropes, and he says by the last tight rope, I'll actually have to break physics in order to beat it. There's speed running tight ropes and disappearing tight ropes, and apparently tight ropes that will completely violate geometry. But in the end, only one car can succeed before I go completely insane. So let's do this. I'm not gonna lie, balancing is one thing, tight roping is like my kryptonite. Sloping, decrepit, pipe. Tight rope. The problem with tight ropes is you need patience, and that's the one thing that I didn't put any stat points into. I promise these windmills were here when I. Yeah. You just randomly decided to build the course in the middle of the wi the wind turbine farm, eh? I decided we would try speed for the very first car, and it is just barely narrow enough to fit on this tight rope. So here we go. Oh, the pipe like destroys itself. I didn't think about this either. The car kind of bo bottoms out very quickly. <laughs> I never thought that I would be doing a tightrope challenge where I would need any amount of suspension. This hadn't really crossed my mind. Clearly, I was mistaken. Now, I feel like I... Oh, maybe not. I was going to say, I feel like I could do this given enough time, but patience is stupid here. Uh-oh. All right, well... Uh, that puts a damper on things. We got a real problem because uh, we got a challenge that I can't brute force my way through and I don't like that. Now, it also could be that I simply picked the worst car in the entire universe to do this with. That's probably the case because no matter how slow I go, if I eventually come up to the wind turbines, I'm going to get kicked in my vehicular groin until I go flying across the board. I mean, more of a personal challenge than anything, I did manage to get this car all the way up to the very first wind turbine. And then I failed. Spectacularly. The underbelly of paradise. This is not what paradise looks like. In fact, I don't think I've ever seen what paradise looks like. All right, here's the plan. We're gonna go with something with a little bit of ground clearance. Now on the plus side, this is also fairly narrow, and it has a pretty strong engine on it. So it's got a little bit of everything. Oh, yeah. That was a terrible idea. Okay. All right. Yeah, this is, uh, this is probably the worst starting challenge I've ever had. Now, I know I say that a lot, but ah, come on! What I was going to say before I went completely insane is I know I say that a lot, but it's because Alex keeps evolving. <laughs> like, it eventually gets to the point where... The very first task. Oh, God. We're gonna try the ATV. Oh, come on, man. Don't laugh at me on the license plate. It eventually gets to the point where the very first task is so impossible that I already contemplate my future. So this is doing fairly well, and it's short and narrow. So it has kind of everything. Oh, what was that? What I was gonna say is it has everything going for it. So the only thing I have to do is to make sure that I make it past the stupid wind turbines that you just had to put. Well, you didn't put them here, but you just had to put the course right there. There we go. New personal best. PB right there. First wind. No. First. God. First wind turbine. Done. Quad. Gonna do it. Gonna go all the way to the end of the challenge. You may have laughed at the quad in the beginning, but when I'm com God, hold on. No, 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 no. Very slight turn. No, 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 ah, come on. But when I'm beating your board with this sad little, whatever this is supposed to be, like a Rubicon knockoff or something. All right, I'm gonna wait for this and we're gonna go. Oh my God. That almost felt like the wind turbine glitched through the ATV, but whatever, I'll take it. So now it's mostly a matter of getting 90% of the rest of the way through just sheer determination and mental anguish. And then we have to speed it right at the end and miss this final wind turbine. And I'll finally beat the very first challenge. Okay, here we go. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. 
Wow! I hate myself. I hate myself because I decided to do it patiently and it takes forever and I'm not doing that anymore. Ow! If you're watching this, then yes, I eventually did have to go back to patience because I was losing my mind trying to get past this. Just let me have it. I can, I can get right here. Just let this happen. We're here. We've got it. Just, it's just, okay. Okay, I can't go forward any more than this or I'll go flying. So I have to time this right, and then we're gonna go. And we're gonna be fine. Oh no, no, no! Oh please. Oh, God of tight ropes, don't abuse me any further. Yes! Yes! Yeah! Finally! Wow, that was awful! Oh my God, what is next? Oh, this, this wind turbine doesn't know how to spin. What goes around comes around tightrope timed. Oh, well, thank you for mentioning that it's timed. Hopefully there's a number so I get to know exactly how much time I have before my life ends. 16, that is a very specific number. Okay, uh... Do you have to figure eight this? I had to figure eight this whole thing in 16 seconds? I mean, maybe it's not that bad as long as I don't get hit by the windmill. All right. So yeah, we'll just, uh... Oh, I looked at the other windmill and I fell off. 16 seconds. And go. Okay. All right, doing good. Oh yeah, Gray's mental clock is going. I've got it all timed in my... Ow. I broke my spine. Just kidding, my spine's better now. Okay, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Oh yeah. Oh, this is smooth. This is, oh God. Okay, I've been at the figure eight for a while. We've got a problem. We need a real car for this. Indy. Oh, sure. How does it do on the pipe though? <laughs> Not great. <laughs> I never thought I would have this much trouble with a concrete pipe in my life. Although I guess, to be fair, I never thought I'd be driving over this with every stupid car that I could be given. Okay, this run is good. This run is awful. I'm gonna land on- You gotta be kidding me! Sticks to landing! Ah! Oh, <laughs> it's right there. Okay. Oh, yeah. Okay. See, the good thing is- Yeah, there we go. Okay, good. There's a special speed that this thing can operate at on the pipe. And it works great when you have this speed. When it comes to the figure eight, I think this is going to be able to do it. It just corners better. I know that feels weird because it looks like a sad dollar store version of the A-Team mobile. But here, watch. It follows these corners really well. Oh, yeah. Oh, this is great. This... What is this? What is... You thought you could avoid the windmill. LOL. Are you kidding me? Because this site doesn't have a windmill, it doesn't count? <laughs> All right. I don't care how many times it takes. Oh, I don't care how many times it takes. Okay, so you have to go to the right and then transfer to the left. So the, that, thank you, yes. There's no way to get past this without dealing with the windmill. We're gonna go to the end. We're gonna start with speed. There we go, that's good. So we're starting with some forward momentum. That means that we can dodge. Oh yeah, that is smooth. Thank you, Alex. I will remember this day for all time. This is what I'm talking about. Oh, no! No. I was right there. I need something even faster. My side-by-side -side has done quite well for many a challenge. And so, we will see. Even though as good as it was on, like, uh, balancing and stuff like that, we'll see how good it is on tight ropes. Oh, it is a glitchy mess on this thing. Oh, God, no. I'm not gonna lie. This might be the worst vehicle for this. Oh, hi, Mr. Deer. You look delicious. Do you not, do you not care? No problem? Have you, have you been so abused by the populace of Los Santos that me driving literally into you doesn't matter? Okay, I've gotten, this is, now this is, okay, well I learned something this, this, this side by side can't do. It cannot do the tight ropes at all. Ever in any capacity, huh? Hadn't really thought about it. Maybe this is good at this. And it's got a really weird sucker. <laughs> okay. It's got a really weird, like, wide wheelbase that you wouldn't think it would have. So can it? Oh. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I like it. Okay. So far, so good. It's got some. Uh, 
Ow! It's got some scars now. What I was trying to say is it's got a little bit of extra hold on this thing. The only problem is it doesn't have any pickup. So it's like, how do I even get past the windmills? Because I can't go fast enough. Like at all. Look at that. That was in the middle of the chassis. Oh, hold on. Just a moment. Sticks the landing. Okay, this is... You know what this thing is good at? Getting beaten to death by wind turbines. God, this looks stupid. Oh, well, is that, is that what I'm going to, is that what I was going to be feeling when I finally decided to choose this? Because you're right. Wow. Huh. Hold on. I think this could work. This thing sounds like someone put a weed whacker inside of a vehicle, but oh my God, it's legit. <laughs> This car is amazing at tight roping. How many miles to the gallon does Oh Well get? I'm kind of curious. So this, I, man, I think we're gonna get past this timed one. I don't think this is gonna be an issue. Oh yeah. Oh speed. Oh, I get to have it. I still have like four seconds left. Three, two, one, zero. Look at that. Got it. Yeah. How? Dare you tree. Uh, what kind of environmentally friendly tightrope is this? Is it a tree? Tightrope tree? Is this really that bad? I mean, it's kind of wide, actually. Yeah, doesn't seem so bad. If it's not timed, I gotta tell you, I am really happy that we uh, can have. Ooh, all right. Uh, the foliage is. What was that? What? 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 I just hit. I felt something squishy under my tires. The power, the power of Satan. Uh, oh, I might not make this one. Yeah, never mind. I got it. Okay, so I went on the ecology tightrope over here, and I think there was like a person or something because I hit something. Can't see because of all the leaves. Yeah, right here. What is that? What is that? Is that a monkey? Did you put a monkey in the tree? Why is he so depressed? Oh God, hold on, I gotta, I gotta pull it. Like he didn't even try to dodge or anything. I'm sorry. He's just sleeping everyone. He'll wake up, he's hung over. He's been drinking. Oh my God, I can't. Okay, now I can kind of understand why this tightrope is this bad. I have no idea where I'm going. God. <laughs> Okay, I, I can kind of see it. it. It just takes me a little bit. There we go. All right, so just kind of... Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, this car is the best. This car is the best. A one time! No! No! Yes! 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 Oh, God, I love neon colors. We're doing it good now. Hold on, I went way past that. Now you see me. Now you don't tightrope. Is this gonna be like invisible tightropes? It's invisible tightropes, isn't it? We did invisible wall rides, so it's only a matter of time before the invisible tightropes happen. Take your time, but don't forget you're being timed. Chunks of it are turning invisible, like large chunks. You can see a bunch of them just kind of flickering. It looks like uh, someone didn't change one of the bulbs on their Christmas lights or something. And then it says a minute and 30. I just don't know what happens after a minute and 30. Does it does it start when I go on it or does it start somewhere else? Okay, I waited for a while and yes, the entire tightrope falls to the ground. So you got a minute and 30 and you gotta go. Now, oh my God, I hadn't really thought about this. Fortunately, this car is absolutely incredible at getting to this point. The, the speed that this thing does the rest of the course up into the tree, it's like just the tree alone takes more time than the entire rest of the course because I can You need to make sure to leave on the left. Yeah, this way the bumper doesn't get caught I can speed run the rest of the course at this point. I'm just testing something. I want to make sure Okay, I just want to make sure that it's invisible and it's not disappearing. All right, get ready. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go and Okay, so now I just need to make sure that I'm really know that I'm really straight when I'm on the invisible parts, but the invisible parts aren't that bad. Oh, this one is because it's super long. Now again, I have a minute and 30, so that's probably like the longest timed event I've- Oh my god, this is long! Okay, we're back. That's not good. I can feel my anxiety rising like a storm! <laughs> okay, 
And I have to go upward. So we got like a sloped tightrope. Oh my god. And it's an invisible sloped tightrope. This is okay though. This is okay. So this is oh thank god. I was like, this better not be a a ramp or something. I I my internal clock can't do a minute and thirty while I'm trying to concentrate like this. I have no idea how much time I have left. I, I feel like it's around like 15 seconds or something. I don't think I can beat this in time. I don't think I'm gonna get it. Come on. I Oh the whole it doesn't it doesn't appear! You just have to do it while it's invisible! Oh it's a checkpoint! No joke. I need a different car. I don't think that this can even get past the first challenge, but I'm gonna try it real quick. I need something that's even faster than what we have. And that doesn't overcorrect as easy. This is gonna be awful. <laughs> I can already tell. There's no way. There's no way this is even making it past the very first challenge, which leaves me with like two cars left to try. I think that's all I have left. Oh, oh, oh. Maybe saying yourself, Gray, how have you been doing with this car? Terrible. Ah! Okay. All right. I've got to pick something else. I appreciate that they give you a shovel on the front of this car because then it can dig its own grave. Yeah. Enjoy the afterlife. Okay. I'm willing to give it a shot. I don't know if it'll just bottom out on the pipe or what, but I have been at this for, oh God, no. I was gonna say, I've been at this for so long that patience is just out the window now. If it can't one shot this, it does, I don't even, ooh, okay. Maybe it can one shot this. Um, I need to try this again. The turning on this thing is not fantastic. But it definitely, ugh, it can definitely hug the pipe well, and then it just pops at some point, like the bumper catches on something. All right, man, you better be the one. Also, special Amazon delivery, enjoy that. Can have a sadness sandwich. Oh, king, okay. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 oh. All right, it popped at the, it kind of in the same place the other car popped. I'm not gonna lie, it, it feels, Oh, it recovers really well. This car, when you go off to the side, it recovers amazingly. Wow. All right. Okay. Uh, yeah. Very smooth. Ooh. Very smooth turning. I like it. It's gonna be, this is gonna be real close. Okay, I, I can do this though. I'm, I'm learning how this car feels. I should say I know how the car feels. I just haven't really, oh God, I just haven't really tight roped with it much. You know what, hold on, hold on. <laughs> we're gonna, yeah, we're gonna get another try. We're gonna get another try. Hold on, hold on. <laughs> so watch out for the, the wind turbine and then a little bit of gas here and there. Good, 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 good. And then a little, ha. Ah, I have to pump the gas way more. I love the taste of anguish in the morning. I've done this a couple times now. I kind of know. Yeah, you really have to push it at the end and then you'll get it. You get it with about a second left. This shouldn't have any problems with the tree tightrope. Watch this, we're gonna we're gonna run right through this. Assume, assuming I can see where I'm going. I'm sorry. I hope you weren't endangered. Bye. He's fine. It'll be all right. In fact, he was uh, like a cat that gets stuck in the tree. See, he wanted to, oh, there's another one. He wanted to get down, so I helped him. That's what happened there. That was an assistance. Yeah, no! Okay, patience, patience, Greg. There you go. Then you don't have to do the board another 200 times. All right, get ready, because we're one time in this. Here we, come on. Come on, do it, do it, go. I tried to straighten it out while I was waiting. I was trying to get the tires as straight as humanly possible. This way I can kind of keep, yeah. I can kind of keep good speed the whole way. Now, I don't know if this tickles your anxiety the same way it's doing to mine, but if you notice, half of my wheel does not fit on this tightrope at all. Even when I'm perfectly centered, I'm still missing half the wheel on one side or the other. This is great though. This is definitely my personal best, so, oh God. What I was trying to say 
is this is definitely my personal best so far with a car. I feel the most comfortable in the Canis. Yes, I do kind of wish I could see this when I'm climbing up it because my margin of error is basically non-existent. And I have to, God, lady. no, 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 please. Oh, I'm losing time. <laughs> I'm slowly going insane. Well, <laughs> oh, oh, can I? Oh no, there's no way to save it. <laughs> I say slowly going insane. It's kind of speedily go. Well, it's only slowly going insane because I have to do these challenges at an unreasonably slow speed that I'm not used to. Precision isn't really my strong point. Like you wouldn't want me as a surgeon. <laughs> Let me put it to you that way. I don't know what to do here. The whole, there's no, you can't, there's no way. Like I basically have to guess. Okay, go, 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 go a little bit more. No, I still had time though. I'm getting to the point where I probably have like 15 or 20 seconds left to do this. And there we go. No, I was right there. I'm, I can get so close, but I have to be perfect. This is the run. This is the run. Oh God, no. It feels like a winner. It feels like success. It feels like it could Come on. also let me down really, really badly. There's a checkpoint. It's right there. Oh God, no! <laughs> I think I literally have 20 seconds left right now. It may be less. Okay, we're gonna, this looks good, this looks good. Go, 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 go. Finally! Oh my God, we have a checkpoint. That was awful. The final checkpoint is moving. Spinning speedy boss tightrope fun thingy. Do not put the word fun in this. So while I've been sitting here waiting for this to come around, I figured out what you have to do. You have to follow this all the way to the middle. Now, if I had to guess, hold on. There's probably a teleporter or something. Oh my God. <laughs> yep, there's a teleporter and he put bumps in the way. This is really difficult to describe, but it kind of feels like you're drifting the whole way. There we go. Yeah. So now we have to do that again. It's just much longer, basically. This one is like way longer than the pink one. Here we go. Okay. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, and <laughs> because as you move further from this, the center of a circle, the centrifugal force is like increasing. So basically what happens is all of the drifting happens in the beginning of the pink one. So I'm almost driving sideways here, but then it kind of like, uh, but then it kind of levels Ah, whoa, yeah. Then it kind of levels out. The problem with this fruit by the foot banana flavored roll up of agony is it starts easy and then it gets worse as you go further out from the center of the circle. I'm not gonna lie, Alex, this is pretty ingenuitive of a tightrope, but I'm starting to learn the pattern Okay, and then more, more, more. Oh, you have to like grind the last bit of it. I know at the end, it kind of looks like I'm doing a YouTube camera angle. This is so I can tell where the front of the car is because you have to grind the car. We're gonna do this. We're gonna win. We're gonna win. We're gonna win it. I love it. Well, I balanced on the tight ropes, and the tight ropes imbalanced my psyche. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode of GTA. Till next time, stay foxy and much love.